play some dive kick. Add. Add screen region. Dive kick. Okay. Now let me help. Let me change the game. Change the game. Play dive kick. Broadcast updated. Thank you. Both those viewers are probably me. Dive kick. I like dive kick. Dive kick's fun. The chat's in the way. There we are. Yep. I'm streaming. Thanks, XSplit. I didn't know that. Why not? Why not dive kick? I wish I had a kick box. That which that's what makes it, right? Dive kick. Because dive kick's fun. Okay. Okay, that's the correct link. Okay, let's play dive kick. Okay. I gotta click on the game, I guess. Okay. Now I gotta dangle this. Just give me a second. This is going to probably look weird for a couple seconds. Here, can I hide X split? Hide X split in the screen region. Sorry, I'm just getting everything set up. Here, tools. Okay. Okay, view. Here. Oh, I can't lower the resolution about doing that. Changing the thing. Okay, so. Okay. I'll just lower dive kick once I get in there. So it's gonna, you're gonna see see some screen doubling for a little bit. Okay. Okay. Video. Should be doubling now. Hopefully this is working. Let me see if how it looks on the stream. How it looks on the stream really quick. Okay. Stream, you working? Yep, it looks fine. Okay. And since there's nobody else really watching, oh well. I'm just gonna play story mode. Because why not? Who do I feel like?
Let's see, which character do I want to be? Yeah, let's keep it basic and just play dive. Because why not? Let's give dive to dive, Jim, because that makes sense. And let's give him the green suit. His green's better color. Yep, dive and kick are pretty much spoofs of, I think, Fresh Prince of Bel Air. They were born and raised in West Philadelphia, then they got in trouble, and their mother sent them to Bel Air to live with their uncle. Pretty much. Pretty much. Um, Fresh Prince of Bel Air, I'm losing my mind here. I might do. I'm gonna do a proper video on this probably. For now, I just want to bring in 24 team of dive kick because why not? So yeah, dive kick is a two-button fighting game. You have two buttons. You have dive and you have kick. Your objective is to land a dive kick on your opponent. First one to win five rounds wins. You have special moves and kick factor, and you can cause an opponent to become concussed if you kick him in the head. That's basically, the gist of it. That's how dive kick works. Not very complicated, and that's why I like it. The the health bar is pretty much superfluous, as one hit is one kill. Or that can happen. Double KO. That happens a lot. Double kills are double KOs are fun. And now I'm using a pretty easy character of dive. Dive and kick are pretty much plays on play on to Yun and Yang from Street Fighter. They, but they're played very similarly, but are slightly different. Dive is better at diving, which is the jump action, and kick is better at kicking. Parabolic arc. That's one of the first times I got the parabolic arc to work for me. So, let's see if we can fraud, fraud this guy. So why not? There we are. I know I'm using an easy character to dive, like I said, but I just want to use an easy character to get back into it. You said it dives. Better the Master 2 than 20,000. That's why I hate most other fighting games. I can't play Street Fighter for beans. I can play this, though. Two buttons. That's all you need. Okay, it's Redacted. I think the story behind Redacted is that he used to be I think Redacted used to be called Wolverine, then for copyright reasons they couldn't use Wolverine, so they decided to hit, run with the joke and name her Redacted. I think that's how it goes. So I'm play I like the I mean I know I'm probably playing more conservative. I usually like to play more conservatively. Don't really like to be too offensive. Okay. There we are. Dive kick. You dive and kick. Fun fighting game. Okay. There we are. Get kick factor. You're in a minute. Kick factor. That didn't last long. Oh well. You can't tell I am playing against the AI, so yeah. That's hardly why I'm winning. I do have the AI on the darn tough difficulty, but still, the AI isn't exactly hard. Well, it can be hard. Hmm. I guess. I don't know. It's a fun game. That's all, all I think. Okay, we're fighting in Fresh Prince of Bel Air style. I think Kick is pretty much Will Smith. Is Dive Carlton, I want to say? Hmm, I think Dive's Carlton. If I knew the, all the words to the Fresh Prince theme song, I'd probably be singing it right now. But yeah, this is the story mode, quote unquote. Because the story mode in a fighting game is the best part, you know? Everybody cares about the story. Ah, didn't kick back far enough. Didn't kick back fast enough. Round two. Kick. 
Whoa, I kicked way too early. I've won the first two fights, no problem. Now I'm falling apart. I'm a fraud. I'm a fraud. Well, I'm not a fraud yet. I saved it. Yeah. Can't handle my kickback. I should have done that terminal velocity there. I should have kicked a little bit first. That parabolic arc works wonders when I get it to work right. Yeah. Yeah, concussed people are easier to hit. The concussion works is that if you hit them in the head, they're concussed for five seconds the next round. It drains all their meter, and they can't build any meter, and their dive and kicking abilities are lowered for those five seconds. I think that's how it works. And you can string headshots together, and it's, you, get, you get something like Unreal Tournament, where it's like, headshot, double kill, multi-kill, on a rampage, and total domination for five in a row. That's how it works. I, I just like how fast this is. All other fighting games take way too long for my liking. Just, hey, I kicked you, you lose. That's how it should be, right? <laughs> oh, I'm sleepy. <laughs> Wish I had a kickbox. I don't know if it's compatible with the Steam version. I'm playing on the Steam version, if I didn't say that already, but I don't know if the kickbox is compatible. But it'd be pretty neat, just a whole controller dedicated for two buttons. I personally find that kind of hilarious. You make a whole fight stick just for two buttons. <laughs> Funny. But still, I want one because it looks cool. And plus, it'd be authentic if I had one. These things are probably about at least... They're probably... If I had to ask a price, it's probably too expensive for me. I probably couldn't be able to afford it. Now, Kenny's my favorite character in this. What Kenny does is that he takes one of the... He takes his dive and kick randomly from one of the other fighters. That's... He's basically hitting the random button every round. Except he has his own special... Air special and ground special. Kenny's probably my favorite character. I might play as him after I get after I beat Story Mode with Dive. Spirit Bullet. Perfect. Full health. Ah, got too greedy. That's why I like to play conservatively. Well, he's the Baz. Well, I was gonna say Baz is usually pretty easy, but nope. <laughs> Whoa. There we are. Okay. Come on, kick, come on, dive. Well, that was dumb. <laughs> I'm bad at this game, I should be fired. Okay, I think this is fight six. I think each story mode is nine fights. You do a stage fight at fight three and a stage fight at fight six, and the final boss at fight nine. I think that's how it goes. Opponents one and two, four and five, and seven and eight are randomized. Three is always stage, six is always stage, and nine is always final boss S kill with infinite kick factor. Because why not give the boss an unfair advantage? Now, if I haven't explained it, the kick factor, I think it increases your stats by a lot. I forget the exact number. It increases your dive and kick, diving and kicking by at least 50%, maybe 100, double. You go really fast. That's what I'm trying to say. And you can use you can use special 
your ground special and air special ad infinitum until your kick factor runs out. Even though you're, even though the special moves drain your kick factor faster, you can use them it potentially use them infinitely. You just run out of kick factor before you can abuse it. Which is what which is what final boss S kill does. Yeah. The infinite kick factor is kinda cheap. Who would have figured? It's not unbeatable, but it's kinda cheap. But again, it's a it's a fighting game final boss, what do you expect? Fun dive. Oh, I took a dive right there. Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. And now you're gonna leave because I made a bad pun. Sorry. I beat I beat story mode once with all the characters, and I like using all the characters. That's why I kind of I guess is why I like using like why I like using Kenny. I get a different character every round. It keeps it fresh. The only character I, I have a hard time using in the stream. His kick is his kick is very unwieldy and pretty slow. So he's the only character I have a hard time using. S kill took me a little bit to get used to, but I got used to him. Baz took me a little while, but I got used to him. Yeah, Jafali was kind of weird, but I got used to him a bit faster. Yeah, I, I like all like using all the characters. I don't think... Of course, there are matchups if you're into that sort of thing. Each char character's trump the other characters. But I think they're all pretty balanced, I say. No one character is overpowered over another. But this not other than Smash Brothers and Mortal Kombat, I don't really play any other fighting games, so what do I know? And now I'm probably gonna make you leave because I said Smash Brothers. Smash Brothers isn't a fighting game, you noob. Uh, eh. You fight people on a game. Fighting you fight people. Isn't that what qualifies as a fighting game? I don't know. But then a beat 'em up would be in that category. I don't know. Labels. It's a game, it's fun to play. That's how what, what I say. Okay, hey, Mark Man. Here. I think one of Mark Man's special abilities is that if you hit the kick, if you kick at the top of his dive, he'll you'll do a special kick that goes faster and stronger and further. I forget what, it's it's just just frame or something. Just, you'll go a lot faster, but I can never get it to work a lot of the time. Guess I'm always off. My timing's always off. I get it to work sometimes, but like maybe once every fight. I wish I could get it to work more. And when I get the kickbox completed, I like abusing the kick. I like abusing the up kick. <laughs> up kicking's really being able to kick upwards is really good in this game. Go figure. <laughs> What does the end stand for? I know he's based off a real person, but I don't I forget what, what who he is. I know Mark Man's based off a real person too, but again I forget. I mean a lot of, a lot of this is tongue in cheek. Dive kick is a, in itself a parody of fighting games, and all the characters are parodies of something else. And the stories of parody. It's, Dive Kick is basically a parody fighting game, to put it simply, and I love it because of that. <laughs> and if you couldn't tell, Mr. N's one of Mr. N's special abilities that he nulls the first headshot. He doesn't get concussed. And final boss, S kill. Let's see, if, let's see if I am able to sweep it. No continues. <sighs> I know S kill is based off a real person too. I think I know, know this one actually. It's Seth Killian, right? He, I have no idea. He did something. I know the name, but I don't know what he did. 
I know Jafali is also based off a real person, and Kenny's based off a real person that of a person that won a kickstart or donated enough for a kick during the Kickstarter campaign to get his brother in the game. I know the Baz is a canceled Street Fighter 2 character that got realized in this game. Dive and kick are Yun and Yang. Mr. N's a real person. Dr. Scholes is Dr. Doom. Kung Pao is Kung Lao for Mortal Kombat. Um, am I missing anybody? I don't know. Oh, Uncle Sensei. Who's Uncle Sensei a parody of? Not quite sure on that one. So, Uncle Sensei's the only one I'm not quite sure who's a, he's a parody of. I'll have to look that one up. Come on. Whoa. Ah, I shouldn't have kicked. Should've just kept back kicked. Should've just not kicked. Ah. Whoa. Bet if I would have back kicked, I would have backed into it. Whoops. Oh, I'm just sucking now, aren't I? Ah, oh, I thought I could. I thought I was ducking under that. Pooh. Oh well. It's the final boss. It's to be expected. You would lose at the lose to this guy. Uh, oh yeah, a couple more things. Kick Factor's a parody of the X Factor from Marvel vs. Capcom 3. The gems, the dive gem, the kick gem, the style gem, and the YOLO gem are parodies of Street Fighter Cross Tekken. And the dive kick is just a parody of the best move in fighting games ever. Dive kicking. Yeah. Is there anything else I'm missing? Ah, back kick, kick back right into that. There goes all my kick factor. Well, I was concussed, and he had kick factor, and I headshotted him. <laughs> if that was a ranked match. I would have gotten an achievement for that. Hear booming outside, they're shooting fireworks outside. It's New Year's. Happy 2014, everybody. Yay. Happy New Year. I got headshot at for your pleasure. Yeah, I only have to continue once. I say that's good. Okay, yeah, dive and dive and kick are pretty beginner characters. They're good for first time players. Yay, happy 2014, everybody. My calculations point to victory. I think I'll I don't know. I think I'll do one as Jafali, then one as Kenny, then I'll call the stream. Cause why not? When I do the video, I'll probably do his be kick then. Okay. Sure. Let's do one as Jafali. I think he's in Jafali. He's weird. I don't know. Hmm. Or Baz. I don't know. I like all these characters. Eh, stream. I don't know. Yeah, I'll just play as Kenny. Okay. Kenny. Oh no. I'll put the style gem on you. Yeah. You get the white angel outfit. Like I said, Kenny's my favorite character. Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> Sleepy. 
Yeah, I think after I beat story mode as Kenny, I'm gonna call it a stream. Okay, Kenny, let's go. The fun part about being Kenny is that you have to figure out who you are in about two seconds, or else your opponent's gonna kick, dive kick you. So, who am I? Oh, apparently my buttons aren't working. That's not good. My buttons aren't working. My buttons. Oh, technical difficulties. Yeah, it would help if I click on the screen, I'm a dummy. Okay, right now I'm Jafali. Durr, I forgot I clicked off the screen. I'm an idiot. Okay, who am I? I'm S-Kill. Okay. S-Kill is weird to control at first, but once you get used to him, he's really good. Okay, Kenny, who am I? I'm S-Kill again. Yeah, sometimes the random lottery gives you the same character every in a row a couple times. Ow, got me on the tail end of that. Hey, who am I? Okay, I'm Stream. I hate. I don't. I don't mind using Stream, but he's probably my least favorite character. Stream just really. He's really floaty. It's too floaty for my liking. Okay. Who am I? I'm Stream again. Okay. Thanks, game. Ah, you got me. Hey, who am I? Hey, seriously, gaming, give me somebody other than Stream. I'd appreciate it. Oh, I just dived right into that. Okay, I'm Jafali now. Yeah, I can deal with that. Oh, that, oh, I forgot. His kick factor is that you die when you touch him. <laughs> Thanks for that. Welp. I lost on the first round. First match. I'm an idiot. Well, I get to start with Kefali again, at least. With a vengeance. Okay. Who am I? I'm Markman. Okay. I don't know. Does Kenny get the blue sparky kick at, as Markman does when he kicks at the, the height of his jump? Don't know. Okay, right now I'm Uncle Sensei, though. Uncle Sensei. The thing about Uncle Sensei is that he, Kenny can't copy Uncle Sensei's hand stance. So I'm Uncle Sensei again. So that's the thing. And Kenny also has his own special moves. He doesn't copy the special moves. The spirit bullet causes the opponent to freeze and freeze for a second, like that. Okay, I'm kick. I think. Okay. Be back with a vengeance. <laughs> Good thing I don't have to go anywhere tomorrow. Okay, who am I? Yeah, I'm, I'm. I think I'm redacted or Uncle Sen. I'm Uncle Sensei. Oh, oh, Markman threw his portal down. Crap, that threw me off guard, and I'm stuck in the portal. Thanks. Okay, yeah, I'm bat. I'm the Baz. I'm stuck facing the wrong way. Well, the good thing about Kenny Baz is that he copies the you touch me, you die part. It's a good thing. Uh, Kenny Jafali does the same thing, too. When you have kick factor, his kicks are all charged up. So I would assume Kenny Markman gets the blue lightning for doing a just frame kick at the top of his dive. I would assume. 
Oh, Mark Man's also a parody of Phoenix Wright from Marvel vs. Capcom 3. He's based on a real character, but he's a parody of Phoenix Wright's character. Okay, now I'm, I'm Mr. N. Okay. Okay, I'm Mr. N again. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the game likes giving me Mr. N this round, this match. It has three Mr. N's in a row. Not that I ain't mine. I like I like the characters that are more vertical than horizontal. Like Kung Pao and Kick, I don't like as much as say Diver, Redacted, or Mr. N. I like the more vertical characters. Although Dr. Scholl's an, is an exception, she can be very horizontal and vertical. She has she has great screen control. She can fly all over the place, and she can cover a lot of ground with her double kick. Dr. Scholl's is pretty pretty awesome. <laughs> Shream can also cover a lot of ground, but he's too floaty and slow for my liking. I guess the good thing is that you can kind of steer his kick up and down, I guess. Still, he goes a little too slow for my liking. <laughs> okay, I'm Baz, okay. The bad thing about ba the Baz's lightning bolt is that you can't get a headshot with the lightning bolt. If you're using the Baz, I was Kung Pao there, if you're using the Baz, you can do a special move where you can do, swing your whip in an arc, and you can kick him that way. But the whip, the whip arc, the whip arc can be really good, but it's the only way you can headshot with the Baz. Okay, I'm stream this time. Okay, there we are. Yeah, that's kill. Ah, I walk. I kick right into that. Okay, Kung Pao. Ah. Headshot at Kung Pao is probably the worst ever. The worst person to be headshot at. But in my opinion, the worst concussed character is Kung Pao. If I had to guess. <laughs> okay, back into, back into Will Smith territory. Damn, that's kill again. In the knee. I wouldn't make a joke about Skyrim, but that's pretty old by now. Okay, now I'm redacted. Or my my Mr. N still. I can't tell sometimes. I think this is Mr. N. Yeah, I'm Dr. Scholes now. It's the first time I got Dr. Scholes with Kenny so far. Okay. I think I'm dive. I have a hard time telling whether I'm dive or kick. With Kenny. It's subtle, but dive dives faster and kick kicks faster. Okay, now I'm redacted. This is definitely redacted. Look at that fast dive. Yeah. That's why I like Redacted. Redacted has a really fast dive. Her kick is really slow, though. Oh, I'm gonna choke. You're <laughs> soon. Don't tongue pal. Oh, in the knee. Okay, that's good. 
I almost choked. I seem to be really good at kicking, but not diving as much. I wonder what determines how good you are at diving and kicking. I get to not losing one, but I never got quite sure how they calculate diving and kicking. Yes, yeah, now I'm redacted. Oh, never mind. I'm not redacted. And Mark Man. Okay. I'm just gonna dive. Okay, redacted. See, this is why I like Kenny. It's different every round, except for those times where you get the same character three times in a row. I'm Baz. Okay. Sorry, sorry if I'm yawning a lot. Uh, sorry. Yeah. Let's see. Oh yeah, Kenny's gonna get his revenge on Mr. N. He care about the story of Mr. N's the one that rigged it to make Kenny die. Yeah. Spoilers. I wish you could skip through the text. Oh yeah, you can. You press yes, diamond kick at the same time. Huh. What do you know? Learn something new every day. Redacted again. I didn't want to use the spirit bullet, but that... I meant to do that. I totally meant to do that. <laughs> that was intentional. Completely intentional. Not a mistake at all. Huh. Hmm. Also, I completely meant to do that, too. I didn't know the Baz's lightning kick could still kick off Mr. N's baggy thing on his head. Head cushion. Hmm. Learn something new every day. Damn, Uncle Sensei. Okay, two, three more to go. Oh yeah, stream. I forgot to cover stream. Stream's basically a parody of people, creepers in the streams. He's basically he's full of memes and flame baits and stuff. One of his special moves is, I think, causing lag, where he, he stays in place, but he still moves around. He has a shadow that stays in place, but he still moves around. So you can complain about the lag, I guess. Nah, I shouldn't have kicked there. I think I was kicked there. Yeah, I was kicking a little faster, so I think that was a kick. Okay. Yeah, that's a kill. Alright, she got behind me. 
Sensei. Oh, that. Oh, okay. I meant to do that too. Sometimes having, the, sometimes firing the spear bullet, making making you hover in the air is actually good. A couple, a couple split seconds of hovering in the air from firing the spear bullet can help. Pro strat for you pro players out there. <laughs> nah, I kid. Double kill. Baz. Round six. Okay, Mark Man. Round seven. Okay, Doctor Scholes. Okay, I just I didn't press the up kick button fast enough. Crap. Dream. Ah, oh, she got me. Dream again. I just, I just lazily glazed into that one. Okay, Kung Pao versus Kung Pao. Kung Pao wins. Seriously, I can't, I can't ever seem to get diving an S consistently, but kicking I always seem to get an S on. Guess I'm a better kicker than I am a diver. <laughs> good text, good text, good text. I wish there was also a way to pause the game. Another thing I have, I'm sure there's a way to pause the game. Because sometimes I need to do something that I want to pause the game. Shoo. Man, that final boss S kills infinite parry can sometimes really suck. Okay, redacted for Mr. N. Mr. N. Redact is a lot faster on the dive. Kung Pao. Okay. Ah, didn't get enough height on that. Finish Dream. Yeah, got him. True. Sometimes stream can be tri streams tricky maneuvers work gooder for me. Gooder. I get English. Okay, I didn't want to fire the spirit bullet, but okay. I'll take a double KO. Oh, S kill versus S kill. Mark man. Oh. Go on, Kenny. I'm redacted. Ah, poo boo. Let's try again. Final battle, might as well finish it. Okay, Mr. N. I, I kicked right into that. It's always uh, it's my I can at least tell when it's my fault. Okay. Whoa! Unlike other fighting games, I have no idea what the heck's going on. Ah! Yeah, I kick keep kicking right into his kick. I think I think the Baz is a good matchup against the S kill. Because the lightning bolt's a slight delay and S kill has to is usually above you when he teleports. So I think the Baz's lightning bolt's a good counter to S kill's teleports. Ah, dang it. 
Should I try to touch him with my I'm gonna kick shock you to death thingy? Mr. N. Oh, he parried me. Hate that infinite parry. Dr. Scholes. Oh, I somehow got him. Oh, mess kill. Uh, parried. And don't ask me how that worked. Ah, dang it. So close. So darn close. Another try. I'm gonna get this guy. Right, Uncle Sensei. Yeah. Yeah. Mark man. Ah. Oh, he perfected me. I'm dying, I think. Got him. I guess the parry must have worn off just as I got to him. Yeah, Uncle Sensei. Aw, weak. Dang. Oh, getting that split second of hanging in the air at the spirit bullet hilt. Stream. Man, dang. Unconscious streams are really slow. Or concussed streams are really slow. Oh, got him. That's the good thing about stream, though, is that you can angle upwards to get him on the upswing. Um, Dr. Scholes. There we are. Good job, Kenny. I think that's I think that's enough. See. Oh, I gotta click on the game again. So that's Happy New Year 2014, everybody. Happy New Year. Here's to more year of games and stuff. Yay. I guess I'll see you guys next time when I do more streamy thingies. Don't forget to check out my YouTube channel, Nat Zoo, for more content, videos, stuff. Follow my Twitter at that zoo for my thoughts on things. And Tumblr, that video game zoo for more video game things. And Backlogry for things, stuff. Anyway, guess I'll see you guys next time. Later.